Hello everyone, welcome back to the crown of the old Iron King. Let's delve back into the memory. See what's in here. I've gone ahead and made myself human this time. Also put back on my ring of life protection. Still gonna wear the crown though, cause it's freaking awesome. And I totally earned it. Yeah, something odd that I've recently realized that I didn't know until just recently is that if you do the backstep thing, which is a move that I pretty much never use, if you do that and then do a normal attack, it actually does that, which I'm pretty sure is the same attack as the strong attack. Or is it? One, two. One, two. I hear two whooshes. I thought I heard three when I did this one. So that's a small... Actually, it is a different attack. That's weird. It seems very, very similar, but yeah, if you do a backstep and then a small attack, it actually does something that's very similar to the normal strong attack. Which, this is the normal strong attack. That's very strange. Holy shit! They do a lot of damage. They're really, really easy to defeat. But if they get get to hitting you, you will get torn up. Alright, well, I'm just gonna run forwards and then just bring him back. Bringing them into a confined area was not a very good idea. That's not exactly where a halberd excels. Well, unless you stab with it. I mean, it is kind of made like a cross between a... a spear... and an axe. But unfortunately, a stabbing motion is not really in my normal attack patterns. Alright, come on. Hiding behind the pillars. The pillars of eternity. That was satisfying. Didn't actually kill anyone. Oh god. Jesus. God, if you fight them one on one, they're so easy, but in a group, they are deadly. Alright, I gotta go repair my rings already. I'll be right back. Okay, let's try this again. I wonder if I could only get one or two at a time if I just went in a little bit. It's kinda hard to tell who I've gotten and who I haven't, though, because I'm usually just running from the explosions from the Drake. What the hell? They're almost like samurai. Let's take a look at these leggings. I feel like I've gotten these before. Can't even really see them. Alright, well I can't be messing around with that because I'm in a memory which has a limited amount of time. Let's just get this one. I didn't even get him. Here we go. Ooh, got two. Oh, no, I think I got a lot. I got a lot. Run away!
Okay, they won't come into here. That's good. Excellent. Yes, run away from me. Put your backs to me. That is incredibly dumb. All right, everybody done exploding? Cool. All right, there's that up there, which I can't reach. At least not directly. Let's go in here. Rusted coin. Eh, let's use them. I, I never use them. Could do some luck today. I don't believe... That's not it, is it? No, it's a charm. Whoa, what the... What just happened? That was weird. Does that mean my time is running out? Where the hell's a coin? Where's the coin? Am I blind? That's another charm. There it is. Looks like I can go get some revenge on this thing. Hi. Can you turn around by any chance? No, you can't. Awesome. I see you over there. Come on. The fireballs are literally going through that night back there. Some wall hacks going on. Hmm, you look different from the others. Oh, yes, I remember you. Shit. Although, I don't think you did as much damage before. Seems like I have so much time in this memory. They said I had limited time, but... I'm certainly not feeling pressured. Whoa, hold on. What's that? Looks like that's where you need to go. Yeah. Down we go. Try luring it out. Okay. What is it? Ugh. That seems weird. What's going on down here? Fucking halberd in small areas. This floor makes me uncomfortable. Come on, samurai. Ow. You son of a bitch.
come on. I feel like this wall might be breakable. Eh, nah, I don't think so. Seems to be just how all of it looks. Okay, so I think I can take damage because of this floor. From the fireballs, I mean. Repair powder, is that a suggestion that I'm going to need to repair? Yeah, that might be the purpose of the open floor. Maybe I can get hit by the fireballs. Yeah, I think so. Okay, multiple ways down. One way forwards. Help me. Oh my god, that is... 397 votes. Alright, well, before I do that, let's go down here. There's a way that goes to the main chamber, and a way that goes somewhere over here. Another weird thing just happened to me. Try right and then treasure. Treasure ahead. Twin blade plus seven. What is that? A twin blade fashioned from rare guy steel, designed for high ranking Dranglaic knights, hence the decorative design. Guy Steel equipment is of the finest to make, but Guy Steel is so rare that very few of these weapons were actually used in combat. One hundred twenty-seven damage. Okay, that's very, very low, and that's plus seven. But it's obviously a very fast weapon as well. I can't even use it effectively. It requires a lot of dexterity. Yeah, so it's a dexterity weapon, not a strength weapon. So it is all about speed. Let's see what this thing looks like. Oh, neat. This is the strong attack. Looks pretty much like the normal attack, except with more oomph into it. I don't know, given the poor damage... I don't really know how good it would be. I mean, if it's going to have poor damage and has a high dexterity, I would assume that it's a weapon that attacks very fast, you know? Kind of like get in there, shred them up with a bunch of small attacks, and then get out but it doesn't seem particularly speedy. It's not slow, but it's not particularly fast either. I don't know. I've never been a dexterity weapon user. Or a strength weapon user, really. The halberd is pretty much neither of those. So I don't know about how that playstyle works. Oh, okay. so this just falls down to where I was going to go anyway, right? Yeah. This place is labyrinthian. It's weird, there's nothing here. Hello. Oh shit, there's another one. Ah, that's where those stairs lead down to. Okay, mapping out the place, almost got the whole thing. Wee! 
Okay, I believe that is the whole under place. Yep. I guess the main point of that was just to find the twin blade. Aha. This is another boss, isn't it? Try dark, in short, weakness dark. I do believe there's a boss in here, and unfortunately I've used up all my dark magics. Alright, who we got? Hello! The Master Samurai! Ooh, beautiful! Look at the reflections in the ground! Excuse me, I'm trying to admire the... Yeah, okay. I'm trying to admire... The graphics, could you please fuck off? Oh, wow. Oh, wow, he didn't hit me. Holy shit, he looks fucking cool. That is so cool, he really is a samurai. Alright, well, it's gonna be one dexterity person against another. This is gonna be a cool fight. I mean, I'm not really a dexterity person in terms of my weapon. But in terms of my movement, yes. Because I don't have a shield. Just trying to learn the attack patterns. I'm obviously not going to win. Oh, I gotta get used to that delayed attack. You are a dodgy bastard. Oh, yep. Yeah, oh, ooh, wow. Well. This enemy is fucking awesome. Causing bleeding too, which makes sense. This is one of the coolest enemies I think I've fought. Oh, I have no Estus. <laughs> Whoops. Alright, gonna have to do this with no Estus. I can totally do that. What if he has phases like the others? Oof. Alright, two hit points? Yeah, no problem. <laughs> I actually went too far around him to the point where I went I went back into his uh, the range of his attack. That is a cool enemy in a really cool arena. There's just something awesome about a sort of dodging and quick character build being pitted against uh, the same sort of a boss that's also very quick with attacks and with dodging. All right, let's put my real armor on. He actually doesn't seem all that hard, to be honest. Unless he has another phase. So, let's see. Can I just run there? Hmm. 
I don't know. The guys that follow me are really fast. We're about to find out. Let's see. Yeah, uh, this doesn't seem like a good idea. No. <laughs> no, I don't think it is. Alright, I'm gonna go repair my rings and I'll be right back. Okay, let's try this again. So, I guess I just fight them. All the small enemies. But just avoid the ones I don't need to kill. The ones down below in the fire drakes or whatever they are. Suppose that'll be fine. Hopefully my weapon isn't going to break. I wonder if I should switch out my simpleton's ring for the bracing knuckle ring. I just, I can't take too much damage because then I'm going to run out of all of my Estus. Alright, let's get them to come. And then, let's get them to turn their backs. Damn you, Halberd! Yeah, I'm actually gonna wear the bracing knuckle ring. What did it look like? There we go. Because that was the first enemy, and already my durability is significantly reduced. I wonder if I can hit you from here. someone behind me. Hey, I did uh, 1024 damage to that guy. That's a common resolution. 1024 for 768. Taking a lot more damage than I would have liked. I'm gonna use some some of my shitty, shitty shits. My shitty healing. Alright, come on, you bastard. That was terrible. Come on! Ah, oh, yes! You know what? I'm gonna go for it. Screw you! Okay, they won't follow me down here. I hear the clinking of armor in there. What are you up to? Jesus fucking Christ, that scared the shit out of me. Huh. Alright, well. Those guys are a bit of a bother. But I have all my Estus. Alright. You can pretty much only get one attack in before he dodges, because he's so fast. Oh, I didn't put my simpleton ring on. Whoops.
Come on. It gets dizzying when you do that for too long. Oh shit. Shit. Oh. Alright, plan seems to be defeat the enemies in the first room. And then run to the next one. In fact, maybe I should go down below. No, no, never mind. That's stupid. Going down below in the second room right before you face the boss? No. Not a good idea. Should I even leave the bracing knuckle ring on? Probably not. It's just that if my halberd breaks during the fight, it's pretty bad. I mean, I'm basically dead at that point. Just in case, I suppose I will put the repair powder in here. Oh, for the love of God, where is it? There it is. Okay. I think I used too many life gems. Alright, let's tease the attack out from the fire drake. Oh, that actually works. Let's be safe here. Worked out pretty well. Thank you. 
Okay, should I run through here? Seemed to work out okay. I'm getting cold feet about it, though. I'm not gonna run. Jesus. This halberd is terrible in here. Come on, get out your sword. Or not. Isn't there another guy down here? I'm a little bit worried about getting too far down there because I think there's another guy there. One of one of these places had another guy. Oh no, you don't. Okay, I think I'm good. Let's get some more gems. Is that clinking again? It's like he's pacing around impatiently, but the weird thing is, as soon as you go in there, he's like meditating. So apparently dark is his weakness. I do have some dark bombs, but it doesn't seem like that'd be fast enough. Could try it. He's so fast, though. Being able to actually hit him with a bomb seems really unlikely. Yeah, I don't think it's worth it. Alright, rings are good. Good to go. Out of stamina. Ooh. Doesn't feel good! <laughs> That's a really cool animation. Oh! Shit, it seems to have charged up his blade or something. What the hell?
Okay, well, I didn't expect to find... that within the memory. But, I'm glad I did. It's extended the length of the DLC by quite a bit. I thought the memory would be short or something like that. I was expecting to get to what these souls that I've collected from the other bosses can make, but I haven't even defeated the boss yet. So, I'm going to end this episode here. I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.